Muy buena gente, estamos en Blues and Bullets, continuando en el episodio 2. Eh, este juego lo subí hace meses, cuando salió el episodio 1, que lo dejaré en la descripción y también lo dejaré arriba en la pantalla, eh, en una anotación para que veáis la, la esta de reproducción, ¿vale? Y en fin, eh, es un juego episódico, como sabéis, y que no lo sepa, pues ya lo sabéis, eh, que dura un poquito, unas 2 o 3 horas cada episodio, digamos, así que eh, eso, que lo sepáis, ¿vale? Y quien no lo conozca, eh, Blues and Bullets es un juego bastante oscuro Con una trama, mmm, digamos, policiaca Y la que no recuerdo demasiado Solo sé que ocurrían muertes y que te seguía la mafia o algo así Cosas raras, la verdad es que es un juego muy interesante Y muy bonito visualmente, la verdad eh, Hubo una, una escena bastante jodida Porque había partes de cuerpo humano por ahí era bastante oscura y daba bastante asco, pero el juego es bastante bonito. Lo vais a ver. Así que, sin más, ha salido la parte 2, que no la esperaba para nada que saliese ahora. La verdad es que la parte 1 ha salido hace meses y ahora viene la parte 2. Y como veis, hay un montón de partes más. Hay 5 partes, 3 más. Así que, nada, vamos a continuar. Y eso, quien no haya visto la parte 1, a tiempo estáis, que son pocas horas, así que... En fin, muy recomendado este juego. Y vamos a darle a la agit agitando la dispero. Vamos allá. Vamos a darle, pues. A ver qué pasa. Escena 1 de agitando la dispero. Vamos a darle. Muy bien. Vaya madre. Que se cae esto. Ya está, ya está arreglado. from some place me no but you do know my boss you should be rotting in jail look Ness my granddaughter Sophia has been kidnapped and I thought I was the only one who still hated you after 20 years what else have you got I don't give a damn what happens to me Ness you just save Sophia I'll do it not for you for her Carlo Baccarini, biggest forger in Wow, esta parte se mejoró. Is that our man? We have to find out who did this and why. Let's go. You're Osman Burke, right? Who wrote this note? Nikolai Ivankov. Calm down, Burke. You were going to meet up with him, right? It's going to be tonight. Did they find those kids? No. How do I look? Like the invisible man in the movie. <laughs> no one's gonna buy it. I'm Osmond Burke, and I have an appointment with your boss. Hombre, mirándolo así, duró poco el juego. Bueno, aparte uno, mejor dicho. La verdad es que este juego es cuanto menos interesante porque ahí, aparte de ser un juego de elecciones, es un juego de... también de... shooter. Hay partes que tú controlas la minilla y disparas a la gente. Es facilísimo, pero está guay, no sé. Está bastante guay. Aunque es cierto que ha costado un montón. Les ha costado mucho traer la segunda parte. Pero bueno. Espero que se escuche bien, la verdad. Espero que se escuche bien y todo eso.
La época es, es acojonante, tío. La época es muy buena. Me encantan los juegos ambientados en esta época. Buah. Adiós. Ah, cuida tu cita. Vale. Hmm. Mi cita está por aquí. Come inside if you like. Strange tent for Christmas week. Here I'm waiting. Don't be shy. Hmm. Tell your fortune, young man. Sí, ¿por qué no? I don't think it'll be good, but go ahead. Oh, I see success at work. Very soon, probably the last in a long time. That's enough for me. You just made my day. Hmm. In that case, I'd better not tell you how the affair with that married woman is going to go. What? How do you know? It's better if I don't tell you. And that's all we're going to talk. For now. You may leave now. I feel someone is waiting for you. Como digo, tiene esa, tiene esa parte oscura. Oh, that was intense. Bueno, da igual. Es por aquí en teoría. Qué chulo ese juego, tío. ¿Qué ponía ahí? Everyone's so excited about the new waterfront. It'll attract the tourists. It'll bring new life to Santa Esperanza. But if we don't get Capone, he'll make sure that it will only bring more death. Vale. Tiene cinco temporadas este juego. No temporadas, episodios. Es un juego episódico. Como sabéis. De la segunda. No veo aquí qué hay. Merry Christmas, sir. Can I interest you in anything? Hmm. Acebo, hombre de jengibre. One gingerbread man coming right up for your little boy or little girl. No, nothing like that. Well, yes, more or less. Merry Christmas. Hmm. Vale, sigamos. A ver aquí. Anything catch your eye, sir? No thanks. How about enough today? Vale. Qué chulo tío. Mierst. Qué guay la escena. Hay mucho filtro eso sí, pero bueno. Hey there. Here for Claire. Thanks. Should I tell her it's from you? Nah, that's not necessary. Shall we walk? I hope someday we can walk arm in arm. Was it hard to get away? Not really. I told Martha I had to check out a tip off. In fact, it's true. That's exactly what Jim told me. On Strawberry Avenue, right? I left him in charge. It's a routine check. I'm sure it's nothing. At the most, some kind of abandoned bootlegger still. 
O'Reilly and DiPietro are with him. Even Garrison joined them to stretch his legs and take a break from the leads in the accounting book. Are you certain there's no danger? I'm not certain of anything anymore. But I had to see you. These last months haven't been easy. We barely see each other. We're drifting apart and... I can't allow this to end badly. How long has it been since you gave me a present? Not for Claire, for me. This isn't right. If we go on, I'm gonna end up hating you. I, I think I already do, almost as much as I hate myself. Delphine. God damn fish! Before, I had you as a way of escaping from Jim. But since you began this crusade against alcohol, against Capone. Damn you to hell, Satan! <laughs> well, on this. Ever since you dragged Jim into these untouchables of yours, Jim Dockers is the best cop in Santa Esperanza and the most honest. You sent him out on a raid so you could see his wife, Elliot. How can you look him in the face after that? I'll tear out your liver, you unholy abomination! Uh, it's not his face I care about, Delphine. When I'm with him, he only talks about you, and, and now you only talk about him? It was you who... You! You screwed everything up, can't you see that? I'll rip your scales out one by one! With my fucking teeth! <laughs> Madre mía. Certificar. Pedir perdón. That wasn't my intention, Delphine. I, I'm sorry. You don't have to be. There's nothing to be done. It's over, Elliot. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna cut you up and just chop you in a little... Will you shut up? We're having a conversation. No, I'm not gonna shut up until I've landed that son of a bitch! Do you want a Christmas punch in the square? Come on. No entiendo qué ha pasado. <coughs> en teoría, ellos dos han roto y ahora la otra así como si no pasó nada. No entiendo esta relación. I'm serious. When I cast the line, the hook got caught round the back in my pants. No. No entiendo nada. <laughs> Just on the seam, you know where. Ripped it right open. <laughs> Tell me there was no one behind you. Well, of course there was. The girl I was trying to impress, and her father, and the rest of her family. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine the scene. There I was, shorts on display. What can I get for the happy couple? Two glasses of Christmas punch, please. Coming right up, with or without alcohol. Amenazar por qué? Ignorar, amenazar. Ignorar. Without, please. Well, of course. Besides, we don't serve alcohol here. No, sir. Amenazar por qué, tío? At the Tipsy Mermaid, we have the greatest respect for the law. Amenazar. What? I think Jim suspects something. Puede ser, sí. Yeah, when all said and done, he is a cop. Elliot, we have to stop seeing each other. It won't be such a big change. Really, I think it's best if we break it off. Jim needs me, your priority is your work, and I don't see any other way. Esperar. All I'm asking for is patience. I'm about to wipe out Capone. We got his accounting book. Garrison is sifting through it. As soon as he ties up a couple of loose ends, we can haul him in for tax evasion. Santa Esperanza will be free, and so will we. What if it takes time to tie up those loose ends? What's the difference? We agreed to carry on until Claire grew up, and that's still a long way off. 
Time's on our side, and then... And then what? If you put Capone away, you'll, you'll find another crusade? Another obsession? Another reason nobody can get close to you? I don't know you anymore, Elliot. You really are untouchable. And I am Jim Docker's wife. Besides, if I want to study medicine, I'm going to need time. I can't steal it from my family. I know, and I support you, but... Two glasses of Christmas punch for the happy couple. The fuzz really screwed up this time, huh? What do you mean? Can't you hear the sirens? On the radio, they're saying four cops got pumped full of lead. Not that I'm glad to hear it, of course. Where? On Strawberry Avenue, I think. No. No, no, no. Jim. Wait. What? Ir juntos. I'll come with you. No. Oh my god. Jim. Bueno. Looks like someone said something they shouldn't have. Whiskey. A bottle. Now. Uh, we don't serve alcohol here, sir. At the Tipsy Mermaid, we have the greatest respect for the law. You took delivery of 12 cases on Wednesday night. Bring me a bottle, or I'll make sure you rot in jail for the rest of your sorry little life. One bottle of whiskey coming right up. Así me gusta. Garrison. O'Reilly. De Pietro. Dockers. Garrison. O'Reilly. La verdad es que apenas recuerdo lo que pasaba en el anterior episodio. De Pietro. No acuerdo ya. Sinceramente. Dockers. Solo sé que el, el hombre este quería vengar a todos sus amigos. Y para ello tiene que matar a Capone. Pero no recuerdo qué pasaba exactamente. Seguramente haga vídeos cortos porque no sé cuánto hubiera este episodio. Eh, lo más seguro es que dure poco. Con mucho. Bueno, con poco, un par de horas. Y no mucho más. Y eso es poco. Sinceramente. Así que igual lo voy dejando por aquí. A ver si se guarda o algo así. Que ha hecho búnker, ¿no? Esta es la... La nave espacial, bueno, nave espacial <ríe> El esto, el... No, bueno, hombre El cepelín, ¿no? Este gigante The 
fucking Negro. Eh... Esclavo. If you know where to buy, they're not expensive. And Theseus is as loyal as a dog. He protects me. Especially when I'm traveling with a heavy load. Jesus Christ, Burke. You're a mess. I'm delighted I finally get to meet the star of the newsreels. Although I won't be able to say I saw your face. Will you be like that for long? Mm, de de mirar, me the doctor doesn't dare give me a date. I have to see him every 15 days. Every 15 days? Is he your doctor or your mistress? <laughs> Vale, así que en fin, dejamos aquí este vídeo por hoy y en fin, la verdad es que es un juego muy interesante y la verdad es que es bonito de cojones. Es cierto que la optimización no es que sea la mejor del mundo, es más, a mí me va por debajo de 30 frames por segundo, así que bueno, veremos qué pasa en el siguiente vídeo, hasta pronto.